Did you ever wonder what happened to Usopp's dials, and why it seems that after Water 7 we never see him use it again? At the end of Skypea, Usopp engages in the most fraudulent trade deal of all time, where after the Skypeans were stunned by Luffy's rubber attacks that made him almost invincible against the Nell's Lightning. Usopp was able to capitalize on their admiration of Luffy's power when he traded thousands of rubber bands for a ridiculous number of dials of varying types. And yet, the only time we see Usopp explicitly use these dials was in Water 7 when he used an impact dial on Luffy and then they seemingly disappeared. But you might be surprised that these dials have been implicitly used in different ways you never would have realized and they're still a core part of Usopp's arsenal. Like when Usopp upgraded to his new slingshot Kabuto, he actually uses several dials with this one weapon, including a flame dial for his Firebird Star, along with a breath dial which gives his snipes greater strength and rotation. But it's not just with Usopp's slingshot, he actually optimized Nami's climate attack and integrated dials in her staff to make it more versatile.